What's up, everybody? What's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome, welcome, welcome to the call. We are about to get started here shortly, guys, and I'm so excited to have you on here. Let me see some flames in the chat. Let me see some flames in the chat. If you guys are feeling good, if you're ready to learn how to launch your new FES business, if you're ready to be able to start this journey, because you know what they say, right? The journey to a thousand miles begins with one step. And for many of you all tonight, you're doing that. You're making that first step into entrepreneurship. You're making that first step into financial freedom. You're making that first step into changing your lives. And I'm so glad that at 13 people, we got three people who are fired up. That's awesome. We got three people who are excited to be able to change their lives, guys. Listen, we don't gotta be here, right? I need y'all to engage. I need y'all to interact. Drop some flames in the chat. If you don't know how to use the chat, it's the little button down there to the left or possibly in the middle of your screen. It says chat on it. Hit the little three dots, it'll pop up. You can hit that and then you can write in the little comment box it says type message here. And you can go ahead and put a flame emoji right there at the bottom. If you don't know how to do flame emojis in your phone, just type the word fire. And that's cool too. <laughs> Guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm so excited, man. Uh, my name is Joe Johnson, and I am a vice president here with this amazing company called FES Financial Education Services. Now, if you are on here, I can only assume a couple of things, right? Either one, you are a brand new agent, you just started this business, you have no idea really what you're doing. You don't even know what the next steps are. You just know that you saw an opportunity. It really piqued your interest. You wanted to make some money or possibly leverage the services that we had available. And now you're ready to learn what to do next. That's the first thing. The second reason someone probably is here is because you're already an agent, right? But you kind of had a rocky start. You really want to be able to elevate and take your business to the next level. So, hey, nothing wrong with that. Sometimes we need a refresher, right? And that's what we're here for, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here to give you guys that refresher. I'm here to give you the next steps on getting started, right? My business does anywhere from $100,000 to about $250,000 every 30 days in sales revenue. It is a six-figure online business, and I help others do the same exact thing. 2021 is going to be an amazing year. We are going to absolutely change the lives. So with that being said, guys, let's go ahead and jump right in. We are ready to launch. Now, first thing first, as a brand new agent, right, it's very important to take advantage of our launch documents. You can actually find this in your myfes.net website, myfes.net website. That's gonna be accessible to the little email that you would have gotten when you first signed up. It'll give you a link that'll take you right to it. It's gonna be the email that you actually created and they're gonna provide you the password that you wanna go ahead and use to be able to sign in, all right? This is gonna be right there under the getting started right tab and it's going to be able to really break everything down but today we're going to go over it okay so number one new agent checklist the first thing you want to do is really download the apps right we have the uces app which stands for the united credit education services app and then we have the fbs agent app which is the financial education services agent app that's specifically for the business now as you download those apps those are going to be allowing you to basically leverage your services leverage the business directly from your phone in addition to that, okay, you want to actually activate your protection plan services. I cannot begin to tell you how many people make the huge mistake of joining this business and not setting up their actual credit service and not sending out their letters. Listen to me. Whatever you do tonight, before you go to bed, before you hit the sheets and touch that pillow, I need you to activate your services. It takes literally maybe, maybe two minutes, right? If you don't do this, your attorneys will not know to start working on your credit. And they don't know to start working on your credit, you're not gonna see items be removed. And if items are not removed, you're not gonna be able to have a story. For example, right, two days ago, three days ago, my credit update over 79 point increase, right? Because FBS, excuse me, UCES, our credit program, removed over 20 accounts of student loans. So my credit score jumped, right? because of this organization, because of this service. So wouldn't you like to have a story like that? You gotta leverage the actual program. Now, if you get your first five, right, in the next 30 days, you will not have to make an $89 payment. That five can consist of referrals or business partners to join your business. So take advantage of that. 
Third, we want to go ahead and set up our direct deposit. It's very important to set up your direct deposit. We get paid every single Thursday. If you don't actually have your direct deposit, then you will get a check in the mail. But I don't know about you. It's something just about when that money hits your bank account, right? You wake up on Thursday, you see that money with the plus sign, financial education services, it makes you feel good. It makes you smile. So make sure you set up that. You can do that right through the myfes.net website as well. And we want to also upload a profile picture, guys. If you don't have a profile picture on your website, people will not be able to recognize who you are, right? It's crucial to be able to identify yourself because that's your website. Think about it. If you were to go to a company, right, and you went to the website, and matter of fact, let's not use a website. Let's say you go to a company and nobody's there. There's no face inside of there. You're just like looking in this business, empty business. You're probably going to think it's closed. You're probably going to think it's not real, right? Same thing with your website. If someone goes to your website and they're excited to sign up, but there's no face, just a blank name, they're going to think like, uh, this probably is not legit, right? So your face is truly your credibility. You can access that by going into the website and in the top right, you'll be able to click on the drop down, and you're going to see an option that says edit profile. Once you click on edit profile, you'll see where it says upload photo, upload profile picture, and you'll be able to go ahead and knock that out, guys. You got to play around with it a little bit. You cannot do this from your phone. You do have to do it from a computer or laptop, so keep that in mind. But next up, we're going to talk about creating our list. We're going to go over that in a second. Attending your first webinar, so congratulations. You've attended your first webinar today. We have many, many webinars like this on a daily basis. You also want to up connect with your upline, sales director. What is an upline? An upline is someone who is above you, right? Someone who either sponsored you or someone's sponsor of their sponsor, right? So anybody that's above you will be considered your upline. Therefore, you want to make sure that you meet your upline sales director because they're a part of your support team. And chances are they have a big part and big influence in your success, right? The tools that are available, the systems that are available, the training such as this one today, right? This is created by sales directors and above. So it's good to know who your leaders are who are helping your process and journey easier. You also want to connect with your vice president. Now, I'm not everybody on this call vice president. I know we got people in all different types of organizations. So identify with your sponsor. Hey, who's my vice president? Just ask them that question, right? Who, who's my vice president? And then you guys can make that connection as well so you know who your vice president is, all right? Locate team training. I need you guys to write this down. Write this down. Every Monday, Easter Standard Time, okay? We actually have training called VP University at 9 o'clock p.m. every single Monday. On Tuesdays at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we have this phenomenal training right here, which is our new agent launch. So you can get your new agents on here and they can see how to be able to start their business the right way. On Wednesdays at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, we have our Wealthy Women Wednesdays. That's at 10 o'clock every single Wednesday. You hear from the top of the top women in this organization, and sometimes men as well, but primarily the focus is on amazing women in this company who started from the bottom, who dealt with everything you could possibly think of, and then some, and they still made it to the top in this company. Very inspirational call. On uh, Thursdays at 8 o'clock p.m., that's when we're going to host our Tune Up Thursday calls. We're going to hop on Zoom just like this, and we're going to go over different scripts so that way you can understand the breakdown on how to be able to articulate either the services or the business or even sometimes what to post on social media. We're going to role play and let you all actually practice saying it out loud with your other partners and colleagues so that way we can grow and be more confident in the field, all right? On Fridays, we've got trainings every day, right? <laughs> on Fridays at 5.30 p.m., we host our Mogul Nation training always led by so many great leaders, vice presidents and above. Uh, and that's a great call to be on as well, to be able to truly understand how this business works and how you can grow. All right, let's make sure everybody's keeping ourselves on mute, guys. Make sure you mute yourselves. I need everybody to check right now. If you don't see yourself muted, let's do that right now. Awesome. Um, in addition, on Sundays, we have our Moguls Elite Sunday training call. Here's the thing. If you're not in Moguls Elite, Moguls Elite is my specific organization. So if you know I'm not in Joel Johnson's business, then this is not applied to you. This is specifically for Moguls Elite. Every Sunday at 530, we have trainings on Zoom. So make sure you get with your sponsor if you are in Moguls Elite. All right. 
So guys, plenty of trainings. There's no excuses, right? If you are busy, if you got too much going on, listen, you can always find time to plug into a training. It's all about what you want to do and what you want to prioritize. And it's important to make sure that you're getting trained in order to go to the next level, all right? Next thing, let's talk about our goals, okay? First thing first, your earning goal. How much money do you actually want to be able to make in the next 90 days? Of course, you're going to have to learn this business. You're going to have to get the ins and outs of it, get comfortable with it. But you want to set a date for yourself. So how much do you actually want to make in the next 90 days? I need everybody right now to go ahead and put that in the chat box. Put it in the chat box, how much you actually want to make. You want to make $500? Do you want to make $1,000? you want to make two, three, four, five thousand dollars ten thousand dollars in the next 90 days? Let's go ahead and see what that looks like right now, guys. Go ahead and put that in the chat. Let me see, let me see, let me see what we got, what we got, what we got. What are our goals looking like? What do you want to be able to accomplish in the next 90 days? I see them coming in. Let's keep them coming, guys. Keep them coming. I want to see, I want to see, I want to see. Go ahead and drop it right there in the chat box. Just put the number, put the number. How much do you actually want to earn? Let me see. We got $10,000. Very good, very good. Keep them coming, guys. Y'all, I hope everybody's awake. Hope we got 15 people on here. Listen, there we go. I'm like, we got 15 people. Hope somebody's listening. We got 5,000. Very good. Carlos said 15,000. Very good. All right. So we've got our goals. Now we got to get the goal date, right? So we know that 90 days from now is probably what? Most likely, uh, we're going to say April 11th. We'll say April 11th. So by April 11th, write that down. You want to be able to achieve $10,000, $5,000, $15,000, $6,000, $5,000 again, right? That should be your goal. So now we know, right, we're going to be committed to this. In order to be committed, you got to know how much you can actually put in investing. So how much weekly time are you willing to invest into your FBS business? Some of us have jobs. Some of us have other businesses. Some of us have kids. Some of us have significant others, right? We know how that can be. Listen, you got to make a commitment for yourself. So how many hours are you willing to put every single week to invest into your business to end up hitting this goal? Someone like $15,000, you know you're going to have to put in some serious work. Because let's be realistic. When the last time we've done $15,000 at our job in three months, right? On a consistent basis. So to do that in FBS, you're going to have to put in some serious work. Now, if you want to do 10,000, you got to put in some serious work. 5,000, you got to put in some serious work. Y'all see in the, the pattern, 6,000, you got to put in some serious work. Either way it goes, you got to put in some serious work, okay? If you want to be able to make your goals happen within this time frame. We're not talking about six months from now. We're not talking about a year from now. We're talking about in the next 90 days. So everyone got their dates, right? All right, let's keep going. Um, weekly time investments, we got that as well. Next, you want to create your list. All right, so let's talk about the list, guys. A lot of people miss out on this opportunity. At the end of the day, this is business tip for you, right? If you want to be successful, no matter what industry you're in, no matter what business you're in, the idea is you have to be able to actually duplicate your product. People have to know about what your product or service is. If people don't know what you do in the marketplace, they're not going to buy what you're offering. The best way and the best offer to have, guys, is an offer that solves a problem. Money is just that. It's a trade, right? People are going to trade their money with you for your solution to their problems. That's all it is. So if you're not making a lot of money in this business, that means you're not helping a lot of people, right? The more people that you help, the more money you're going to end up making. Now, here's why creating a list is important, because if you go through the numbers, guess what? If you talk to five people and all five say no, well, you're probably going to feel like you had a bad day. Now, if you talk to 100 people, and five say yes, you're probably still going to feel like that's a better day, right? You make $500 because we earn $100 per referral. That's a pretty good day, right? But it's all about going through the actual numbers. Think about it, guys. Like, let me do some math real quick. Let's say, for example, you go out there right now, every single day you talk to 100 people, right? It's seven days in one week. $100 times seven weeks, guess what? That's $700. There's usually about four weeks in every cycle. And then we have our fifth week cycle. We're going to talk about that here in a second. So 700, right, leads within four weeks, guys. That's 2,800 leads that you'll be introducing to your business. Now, we do 2,800 times 12 months. That's 33,000 leads that you can be associating with. 
Now let's let's be really honest. Do you honestly think that you won't get a few thousand people in your business if you actually expose that many people? See, a lot of times we like to blame ourselves. We blame our circumstances. And again, this is not um, you know just for FBS. This is business in general. I don't care if you're doing hair. I don't care if you're selling lemonade at the lemonade stand, right? Whatever you're doing, it's all about how many people know you're doing it. How many problems can you solve? And that's how you make the money. So your list is the literal foundation of your business. Every single day, your goal is to increase your list and be organized. Because you can write down, this person saw the information. This person said they're going to sign up next Friday or next month. This person said, you know, they want to get some information later on a phone call. So I'm going to write down a phone call, right? You want to stay organized. Don't just go around contacting a whole lot of people and then you forget who you talk to. You forget who you have to follow up with tomorrow. You forget who said they're going to sign up in two weeks. You forget all of that, right? And it's important to do the follow-up. Fortune is in the follow-up. All right, does that make sense? Guys, drop a number one in the chat if that makes sense so we can go to the next one. If that makes sense. We've written out our goals. We got our goal dates. We know how much we're going to invest every single week, right? And now we've talked about our list. We understand what it's going to be able to take in writing your list. If you're just getting started, the best thing that you can do for yourself, ladies and gentlemen, is write a list of 20 people. You want to do that tonight. You write a list of just 20 people. That's going to really get you on track to moving into the next step. So I see the ones coming in. Awesome. Now, your next question might be like, well, Joe, I get it. Writing a list. All right, cool. But the thing is, I don't know a lot of people. Right. I just I don't know. I don't know who I can really talk to about credit repair. Let me give you some help. Number one, your warm market. Guys, do you know the average person has a minimum of 100 people in their phones right now? Some of y'all have like 500 to 1,000 friends in your phones right now, right? The best thing that you can do is literally go to contact, go in your contact book and just reach out to these individuals and say, hey, I'm starting a credit repair business. And I know it's been a while since we've spoken, but I would really love your opinion on everything that I'm offering. I'm confident that I'm going to hit my goals in 2021. Very simple, right? I didn't just come up with some crazy, a phenomenal script. I'm just being honest, right? I got goals in 2021. I started a new business and I want to get people's opinion. I want them to see what they think about my organization. And guess what? Chances are, if I go through 100 people and out of 100 people, 50 of them watch the information and out of 50 people, 10 of them sign up, I get $100 for every person that signs up. Guess what? I made $1,000 and all I did was sit in my bed and send out 100 text messages. It's that simple. It's all about going through the numbers, right? So now that's your warm market. Who do you know and who knows you? Next is referrals. Maybe someone's not interested in your service. That's perfectly fine. But what you can do is you can get referrals. You can refer me to somebody, right? You can tell someone about me. I just got one of my guys uh, like two days ago, right? And uh, actually not two days ago, yesterday. It was happened just yesterday. Uh, he actually referred to me on Instagram. He said, yo, I just told my boy about you. He needs to get his credit fixed. I said, no doubt. I reached out to the guy on Instagram because he followed me. And then guess what? From that point, yeah, we got his number. I showed him what we do, how we fix credit. He said, I'm trying to get a car. I keep getting denied because obviously we know that credit is very close to getting a car. It's a process, right? Well, I said, look, I got you. I'll take care of you. Here's how we're going to delete your items. He said, okay, how do I sign up? Boom. Guys, I didn't have to sell him. I was referred because he needed the service. And guess what? I'm solving a problem. So that's the referrals. You got to understand, we are not marketing pills, potions, and lotions, okay? We're marketing credit repair. This is a service that people need. Your goal, your mission is to get it in front of the people. Next up, churches, pastors, religious leaders. Get the information in front of your churches. If those are your family, right? If that's the people who support you anyway, share the opportunity with them. You'd be surprised how many pastors got horrible credit right now. And they would love to go get a $10,000 loan to invest right back into the church. But that's not even a conversation they can have because they don't understand credit themselves. Financial Lack of financial literacy is one of the biggest burdens within the communities. You could be the change of all that. You got to start with a conversation. Real estate agents, car professionals, right? They deal with bad credit every single day of their workplace. You can be that connector for them. Tax and insurance professionals, you can be the connector for them. Social media, trial runs and shout outs. Have people shout you out. Hey, listen, guys, on Facebook, uh, I got my boy Carlos, you know, he fixes credit. He helps people remove negative items like repossessions, charge off collections, student loans, late payments. If you need help with your credit, DM him. Here's his uh, information right here. Boom, tags you. 
And now everybody's commenting info like, yo, put me on, put me on. I need help with this. And then Carlos goes in there. He says, hey, thanks for commenting on my boy Joe's page. I saw you need some help. How can I help you? What do you need removed? And guess what? They're going to tell you. And then you get yourself a sale. Guys, it's simple, right? Paid ads. Once you start advancing, you can actually pay for advertising, right? You can literally pay Facebook. Here's the thing with Facebook, okay? A lot of us don't know how to use Facebook. Understand that Facebook is just a big business, all right? It's not just some fun social media app where we all connect and watch girls twerking. No, it's not. That's not, that's not only the reason to use it, okay? You use Facebook as a business. They are loving business owners because business owners do exactly what we need them to do. We pay them to put people, put our information, put our message out there in front of the people. So people come back and say, oh, Facebook sucks. Why does Facebook suck? Well, Facebook sucks because I paid them and nobody signs up. If nobody signs up, it's not a, a people issue. Facebook puts you in front of people. The issue is your message. It's not selling to the right people. So you got to go back and change your message. We're not doing a training on paid ads right now, but that's the primary issue people have. Your message is what sucks, right? If you're putting the wrong content out there, if you're not really solving the issue or showing that you can solve someone's issue within that post that you paid for, well, people are probably not going to do business with you. But by paying specifically Facebook, Instagram, they'll put you in front of the people that you want. You can literally put in the zip codes and guess what? It's going to go into the area that you think people need the service. You can put in demographic, black, white, Hispanic, uh, uh, women, men, right? You can put it in there and you can target. They're going to literally show your ads on those people's timeline. That's the power of paid ads. Only prospecting new friends, right? Guys, this is a big no-no. Do not just stick to your friends. A lot of people join this business and they get so disappointed because they show their friends the opportunity. Their friends say no. And then they say, well, I don't have anybody to share it with. You have plenty of people to share it with. How do you know that? There's 43 million Americans with bad credit right now. 43 million. So until you speak with 43 million, don't ever say you ran out of people to talk to, okay? Also upgrading your customers. This company allows you to be able to upgrade your customers. And you can do that within actually uh, 60 days. Once that customer makes three consecutive payments, they can upgrade for $199 and become an agent after being a customer for three months. Go to networking events, meet other people in your industry and in your marketplace, right? In your city, car advertisements. I've been joking with my friends. I'm serious about it though. I'm going to put, a, I'm going to go online. I'm sure I go to like Petco or something like that. And I'm going to create an advertisement for my dog, right? And I'm going to put on his little back. It's like they have this little, uh, 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 little, you know, ESA kind of support animal things. I'm going to put it on there. My owner fixes credit. So every time I walk my dad, my dog down the street, someone will look and see, Oh, you fix credit, right? Because the idea is I want people to ask me about what I do so I can actually sell them, right? So car ads is great for this. You're driving around the city. You forget the ad is even on your car and people are calling you up like, yo, I was at the light. I looked over. I saw that you fixed credit. Can you help me out, right? Also vendor tables, right? Get into nice events. Ask people who are hosting big events if you can get a table and actually be a part of it. Obviously with COVID, you know, that's a little... uh uh, uh, a little a few events, very few events to be able to do that. But if you do your research, you can find it and then flyers. Next up, guys, business office. You'll be able to find the retail calendar. Here's how our company is broken up. Four, four, five. Okay. If you see here, it's 2021. Right now in January, we had four weeks of our sales cycle. You're going to hear this term a lot. Four weeks. It's the last week of the cycle. We got two weeks of the cycle, right? A couple of days to the end of the cycle. You're going to hear this a whole lot. So, so there's four weeks. And then there's a second set of four weeks. And then there's a five-week cycle in March. And then it does the same thing. It repeats itself. Four weeks in April, four weeks in May, five-week cycle in June. So this allows us to be able to make our payments, right, and be able to get paid every single Thursday. And the cycle ends on the Saturday from the beginning to the end. So for January, the cycle started on December 20th. It ends on the 16th. That's this Saturday. So this is the last week of the cycle. Why is this important? Because your volume that you create, your sales that you're going to bring into your business between you and your team, that's going to assist you in getting promoted. The more promotions you earn, the more your income raises, right? And so you want to make sure that you're leveraging these cycles. Guys, do not procrastinate when it comes to these cycles. You see, oh, I got four weeks to do this. No problem. 
and you wait until the last minute and then you miss your promotion and you're sad because now you're not making the same money that you did, right? Leverage the time that's available. Start your hustle strong on the first week so you can get your promotion by the third week, right? And at that point, you just help everybody else on the fourth week. Put in the momentum early, not late, all right? That's the four, four, five counter guys if that makes sense i want everybody to drop kg in the chat keep going if you want me to keep going if that makes sense does everybody understand the four four five schedule we got four weeks four weeks and then five weeks if that makes sense drop kg if it doesn't make sense drop a question mark in the chat so i can answer your question because remember this is all about you guys right i want you to leave this call more confident about this business understanding what you need to do to move forward so my goal is to help that if you're not understanding if you're having a hard time understanding then let me know so i can answer your questions so i see the kgs coming in let's keep going next up is cabs all right here's how cabs work okay for every agent that you refer to this business an agent is not someone who is only fixing their credit that would be a client an agent is someone who's going to also market the business because they want to earn commission when they refer people to the services as well right so let's say, for example, let me use some examples on here, right? We got a lot of people on the call right now. Let me use an example. Let's say we got, um, we got Zangel and let's see who else we got. We got uh, Aaron, okay, Zangel and Aaron. So guys, let's say Zangel is the agent. She is the qualifying agent. She's super excited to join this business. She's going ahead and going to kill this thing because she knows her boy Aaron is going to plug in. So now Aaron signs up, okay? Aaron's goal is to do what? Get paid. So when Aaron goes out there and gets his first two clients, everybody drop in the chat two, drop in the chat two right now, the number two. When Aaron goes out there and gets his first two clients, he's gonna be very excited because how much money do we earn off a of very referral, everybody? We earn $100. So you just made $200, Aaron, and all you did was say, hey, do you possibly need help with your credit? And out of the people that you asked, two of them said, absolutely. So now you made $200. Now, we didn't forget about you, Zangel, because you introduced Aaron to the business. You're going to earn what's called a cab. The company is going to pay you for helping your teammate get paid. So here's how it's broken down. The initial is when the agent signs up. The remaining is when the agent gets their first two clients. You have about 70 days to help that agent get paid. Now, if you wait 70 days, you're playing with yourself. You're playing with your money. Your goal is to do this within the same week, every week, so you can really max out the compensation plan. So, for example, as an agent, that's $100 when you help your friend get paid. So, Zangel, if you go out there and you help Aaron get his first $200, you're about to earn how much? $100, right? That's the power of caps. I am motivated to assist you so assist me, right? And as a field trainer, now you've been building a team, we're gonna show you how to be able to make even more money. When you go out there, let's say Zangel using you as an example, you get promoted. Zangel goes out there and talks to Corey. Corey signs up, Corey gets his first two clients. Guess what? Zangel, you're about to earn $60 when he signed up and then another $100 when Corey gets his first two clients. That means you got paid $160 when you assisted and getting paid now let's say we got let's say for example joanna joanna is a sales director right now joanna when she goes out there she helps her agent earn their first two clients joanna's going to earn 380 dollars. now if she does that for three people in one week 380 dollars times three that's over 1100 you just made for the week and all you did was help your friends get paid as well is that good or is that good <laughs> all right we are earning money just for helping other people earn more money my position i'm a vice president i earn 500 dollars when i go out there and i help my friends so look if i go out there and i hustle and i hustle and i hustle and i hustle there's there's six days in our sales week right because everything ends on saturday so if i can just help two people every day for six days get their first two checks guys man oh man that's 12 agents getting paid. Now, if I do 12 times $500 in cap, that's $6,000 I just made for the week. Hello. <laughs> we're, we're making money for just helping other people, right? How many of you all can use $6,000 in one week? 
and all you do is do the same exact thing. I do the same thing that Joanna does. Joanna does the same thing as Andrew does. And you're going to do the same thing as a brand new agent as well in this business. And as you continue to grow and help other people, guess what? You're going to continue to level up and make more money. Does that make sense, guys? Drop KG in the chat if that makes sense. If you understand how tabs work and you want to be able to move on to the next one. If anybody has questions about the breakdown of cabs, let me know and I'll definitely explain that. That is the, the very bare minimum explanation of how cabs work. It goes all the way up to $560, which is our pinnacle um, position. But drop KG in the chat if that makes sense and you wanna keep going. All right, so let's talk about volume points, right? So again, when we say something like, hey, look, I'm a vice president and I do $100,000 a month in sales, a lot of people might mistake that as $100,000 like in my pocket. It's not what that is. It'd be nice, right? That's the, listen, that's the goal this year. I want my back office to match my bank account. Hello. <laughs> that's the goal, right? But let's break that down. It's volume. And volume is the amount of sales that you and your team earns, okay? So what that looks like, guys, is for every single agent that you enroll, you're going to actually earn $400 in volume, okay? For every customer that you enroll, you're going to earn $200 in volume. So an agent is someone who specifically wants to market the business and also get their credit fixed. But a, a customer is someone who specifically wants to just get their credit fixed. They don't want to market it. So it's good either way. That volume is going to assist you in getting promoted. Here's the beautiful thing about our company, right? You might be worried because you're like, dang, if, if I get 10,000 this month, how in the world am I going to have to start from scratch next month and do another 10,000, right? What's awesome about our company is the residual. So now, not only does the commission become residual, your volume, your sales become residual. Every single month that that agent pays their $89, that's another $100 coming into your actual back office volume for the next month. Now, the third month they make their payment, you're going to get $85. And that's the third month and so forth, right? Every month after that third month, you're going to earn $85 in volume in your business. Now, as a customer, that's $200 when they first sign up. When they make their $89 payment the second month, that's another $100. And every month after the third month included, it's another $85 in your business. So you're going to be able to continue to earn in volume. Now let's talk about getting promoted, okay? Now that we understand volume, now we understand cabs, let's talk about really getting to the next level, right? I got some big goals. We got 10,000, we got 5,000, it's a lot of big goals. In order to achieve these goals, you're going to have to make sure you know how to get promoted. Here's how. If you're a brand new agent and you just signed up, Right now, and I'm talking about like you just signed up within the last four weeks, this week, and then the last three weeks, right? You have $400 in your volume points right now in your back office. If you log in, you will see it says 400. This is awesome. Here's the thing. That 400 will go to zero this Saturday. So you want to leverage this. You're already closer, one step closer to your promotion. Now, all you have to do is you got to go out there and you have to share the vision with three people who want to start this business with you. Once you get three people that's gonna be with you, they're also gonna to contribute to your volume, which is $400. Guys, do the math, right? 400 that you're bringing in times the 400 that the other three people are bringing in, that's already $1,200 from them. So that puts you at $1,600 in volume. The qualification and volume for field trainer guys is only $1,600 three people <laughs> right how many of you guys think that there are maybe just maybe three people in your entire city or state who are struggling and they want to make some money from home how many of us can really like agree that that might not be as hard as i've been making it right i'm sure there's at least three people who want to be able to make money they just don't know about fes like they tried other stuff before they tried life insurance they tried uh, selling um, uh, pills and potions and lotions. They tried it all, right? It's not working. Well, guess what? They never tried credit repair. If you can share this vision with them, show them the information, you can be able to get the three people that you need to get promoted. Or you can actually go out there. If you, let's say, for example, you did not start these last four weeks, you've been in the business for a while. Well, still, 
not complicated guys you do two agents two customers plus one meaning that if i get two agents right now we all know that's eight hundred dollars okay now if i go out there and i get another two customers that's four hundred dollars that puts me at twelve hundred dollars in volume now what's going to end up happening is you gotta get that plus one whether it's a customer that's going to put you at sixteen hundred or if you get an agent that's going to put you over Right, sixteen hundred. Give me that four hundred dollars in volume, which will put you exactly where you need to be at, which is for field training, sixteen hundred dollars, guys. Y'all follow me? Like either or, you can make this happen, and it doesn't take that much to get your first promotion. A lot of people, right? They'll they'll work at a job and they won't see a promotion offer until almost two years of working there every single day, barely any vacation time, not spending any time with their family because they're always doing overtime, right? Well, you can do this this week. Just go out there and help two agents, get two customers, fix their credit, help three people see the vision and you can get promoted. All right. So drop FT in the chat. If that makes sense, drop FT in the chat. If we all understand how we're going to go field trainer in 2021 and we're going to do it this week. We don't want to wait till next week. We don't want to wait till next month. We don't want to wait in the next 90 days. If we got big goals that we're trying to accomplish, we got to do this now, right? We got to share the vision now. I see the FTs coming in. Awesome. Awesome. Now the question is, man, Joe, I understand volume. I understand how to get the volume. I understand how to be able to go to field trainer. My question is, how do I do it? Here's how you do it. Here is the system. Guys, system stands for this. Save yourself, uh, save yourself time, energy, and money. If you are exhausted, spending all this energy, spending all this time, and even spending money, and you're not getting results, I guarantee you, you're not doing the system. Here is how you work the system, okay? Peak their interest. The less you say, the more you make in this business. You wanna be in a hurry. When you're in a hurry, that creates excitement. Hey, listen, look, Barbara, I can't talk right now. I'm actually in a hurry, but I gotta share something with you that's been on my mind heavy. I'm excited, I'm setting the tone. Now, if I go to Barbara and say, hey, Barbara, so, um, what you doing? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. On me, I'm I'm not doing nothing. I'm 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 chilling, really. Listen, I want to tell you something that um that was on my mind. Probably FES, right? That's not gonna create no excitement. She she ready to get off the phone with me, right? She's like, this guy's boring, right? You got to be excited. And so now you pique the interest. Number two, you clear the schedule. Hey, look, Barbara, I can't talk right now. I'm actually in a hurry, right? But I've been, I've been having this thought on my mind and I had to get it in front of you. What are you doing today at seven o'clock PM? She's gonna look at her schedule. She's gonna think about it. Um, I don't think I'm doing anything at seven o'clock. What's going on? And now you wanna add value. God, you can add value thousands of ways, right? You can give her a compliment, give your prospect a compliment. You can let them know how much they mean to you personally by being transparent with them. Um, you can tell them just a little taste of what we do, right? So for example, hey, I'm, I'm gonna go through the whole thing again for you guys. Hey, listen, Barbara, what's up? Hey, look, I can't talk long because I'm in a hurry. Now look, this has been on my mind and I wanted to see what are you doing at seven o'clock? She's gonna say, oh, I'm not doing nothing at seven o'clock. Okay, great, look, I have looked at you and followed you on Facebook for the longest time. You're one of the most inspirational people I see. You're always being yourself, being authentic. And I appreciate that about you. And I don't think everybody does. Now, I found an opportunity that's as legitimate, that's as credible, and that's as authentic as you are. And all I want to do is get your true opinion of what I'm about to be building in 2021. You said you're free at 7 o'clock. It's a Zoom. Can I get you on that Zoom so I can get your opinion? Guys, do you feel like... Leading with that approach, do you really think someone's just gonna be like, oh, nah, that's a scam, <laughs> right? I'm coming from a real place. Now, if I would have been like, hey, Barbara, look, if you're trying to get to a bag, I got the lick for you, right? It's an opportunity. If you start for 288, you can sign up and join my team right now, and we're gonna market credit repair, and we get $100 for every person that she probably would have been like, nah, I'm okay. And that's where a lot of us do, right? We, we talk way too much instead of just sharing the information and letting the information sell the person. So now that moves us into our S. Listen, FES provides us with tools to share 110% of the opportunity. 
If you don't know how to do a presentation, it's okay. We got third party tools. We got videos, we got webinars, we got online presentations. We can do sit downs with you and your sponsor. Like there's too many opportunities for you to throw yourself out of the equation. And a lot of us, I guess it's our ego. We don't, we don't want to do that. We want to, we want to provide all the information. We want to be able to give the details instead of just having the information do that, you know? And so at that point, once you share the information, you're going to reach back out to them. You're going to say, Hey, look, did you watch it? They're going to say, yes, I watched it. They're going to say, Hey, look, I want to get on the phone with you. I want to get on the phone with you because I absolutely, I have to hear what you think about this. And they're going to say, okay, cool. Call me now. Before you call them, you want to give your mentor about 20 minutes in advance and say, hey, I have a prospect, my friend, my sister, my brother, my mom, she just watched the information and I would love for you to be able to talk to her and paint the vision on what the next steps are. And now, guess what? Your mentor is prepared. They're writing it down in their calendar. They're getting ready to talk to you. Awesome. Okay. At that point, boom, you guys hop on a three-way call. Guess what? All you have to do is let your upline, your expert, do all of the talking, okay? You're going to be like a fly on the wall, just listening, taking in the notes of what it is your mentor is saying. So that guess what? All you got to do is just sit to the back, and you're going to be able to do the same thing for someone else once you start building a team. Eventually, as you grow, you're going to be the one doing the three-way calls. But right now, you got the easy part. Just put your mentor in front of the person. If you aren't doing three-way calls on a daily basis, a minimum of two to five times a day, then I can tell you right now, it's going to be hard making consistent money. Now, the beautiful thing about it, guys, is it doesn't have to be all at one time. Maybe you do a call at 11 o'clock. Maybe you do a call at three o'clock. Maybe you do a call at 11 o'clock, right? Well, the thing is, even if you do that all throughout the day and you get three customers only for that day, $100 times three, guys, is $300, right? If you do $300 times seven days a week, listen, that's $2,100 a week that you're making part-time basis. And all you're doing is putting somebody in front of the information and people come back and be like, oh, well, Joe, you don't understand. I'm so busy. You're too busy to make an invite? <laughs> I would understand if I said, look, you got to do three to five presentations every single day, right? All I'm saying is get them in front of the information. That's it. <laughs> guys drop ps3 if that makes sense and drop a question mark in the chat if you had a question about ps3 just drop ps3 in the chat if everything makes sense you guys want me to keep on going drop a question mark if you want me to elaborate or explain something in the ps3 let me see it let me see it let me see it drop ps3 guys are we here are we plugged in we got 15 people hope you guys are not digging in your nose man hope you're paying attention look this is how you start your business all right, this is how you be able to launch your organization. This is how you get to the next level. I did this every single day for one week. Guess what happened? I was promoted after three days in the business. I did it every single day, every single week. I had senior field trainer. I did it every single day, every single week. I had sales director doing $10,000 a month in sales. Once I got the sales director, I tried to do it on my own. I tried to break the system. I learned very fast. Oops, <laughs> let me get back to the system. I asked my mentor, I said, hey, look, can I, uh, can I still use you? Because I don't think it's working. I think I'm doing something wrong. I try to close my own deals, even though I'm a sales director. He said, yeah, of course, call, use me. Thank you. That same day, close the agent, right? I did the same thing. So I got the regional sales director. And at that point, I was more confident. I had some more checks under my belt. Felt more good on the calls, right? But I followed the system all the way up the top. So you got to do the same thing. All right, perfect. Let's keep going. Guys, network marketing is like school, all right? It's hard to get better and look better, uh, look good at the same time. So let go of looking so good all the time, all right? What does that mean? That means that some of you guys, you don't like to look like you're in the trenches. You don't like to look like you actually are working hard and you know, you're going through it. It's okay to go through it. People actually appreciate that way, way more than the guy standing in front of the Lamborghini, right? You see a guy looking standing in front of the Lamborghini, the masses say, oh, well, you know, he probably only got there because he, he stepped on some people in order to get there, right? But the person who's like, hey, y'all, making this video, just want to let y'all know, look, I'm an entrepreneur. It's not always easy, but I never give up because my dreams are big and I'm not at where I want to be at yet, but it's only because I'm still on my journey. If you're interested in having your own journey, shoot me a DM right now. I guarantee you a small video like that for 30 seconds will make way more of an impact than standing in front of a nice car that you rented saying, hey, you want to make a lot of money? Join my business, right? 
It's just people. It's how they work. They want to be able to know that you're authentic. You're a real person. It's more than the material items. Now, of course, everybody will like that, right, for the most part. But to get them to see the information, because we're in a world where everybody's doing the same thing, it doesn't have a good rep. So don't be afraid to be authentic. Also, be willing to let go of other people's opinion. Guys, if you got a million dollar dream, don't throw it away just because someone with a 40,000 salary is telling you it's not gonna work, right? Why, why are we trying to let somebody else's opinions affect our reality? If you wanna be able to be a six figure earner in this business, then do that. And if you go to your friend who's making less than $28,000 a year telling you, oh no, that's a scam. You know how I know because everybody that does it, look, just because they're in their situation, that's their situation. God put you in this opportunity because he wanted to give you that vision. He did not set them up to have the same vision. You tried, you did your part. But just like Jesus, not everybody accepted Jesus and he had the same vision. He wanted everybody to be a part of it. You got to go through your own journey sometimes. You got to be able to be developed into the, the person that you want to be. It's not going to happen overnight. And if you stop just because someone else's opinion, that means that you didn't believe from the jump hard enough. You got to believe in this thing. You're either in FES or FES is in you. If you want to really take this thing to the top for my people who want to make $10,000, right? For my people who want to make $5,000, right? If you want to make $2,000 a week, you got to believe in this thing. Also, others are not thinking much about you. They're only thinking about themselves. Once again, right? If someone is telling you no, it's not because they just think it's so horrible. It's because they don't see themselves doing it. It ain't got nothing to do with you. It's your journey, right? Look, most people can't handle this, okay? They want fair pay from day one. Let me be clear. If you want a job where we're going to tell you that you got to work 40 hours a week in FES, you got to do 200 calls every single day in order to get a paycheck. If that's what you signed up for, guys, I'm sorry. That's not what this is. See, people will go to work all week long and they'll come back to build this business part-time and they'll say, oh, well, you know, I gotta have more balance. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta try to figure out, you know, I'm always at the office. I just need a little bit more time. I gotta figure out how to be able to, look, it's not about balance. It really isn't. It's about just doing what you gotta do and then getting it done one way or another. Most people are afraid of network marketing because they know it's performance-based. You either rise or fall based on your level of effort and skills. The beautiful thing about this is, guys, as you're growing, you're going to be able to increase your skills. Mm -hmm. As you're in this process and going through this journey, mm -hmm. you're going to be able to increase your efforts. But it all starts now. Because success loves speed. That little adage that we always heard, success, uh, slow and steady wins the race, not in this business. Okay, slow and steady does not win the race in network marketing. Slow and steady gets you killed. <laughs> and what I mean by that is not literal, of course, I'm talking about financially. You put that 288 investment in, you're ready to get money back. And then guess what? You go a whole week, not talking to anybody. Oh, well, I'm busy. You know, this is what I'm gonna, I'm gonna start next week. You start next week, you don't talk to anybody because you got so busy again. Well, I got really, really caught up this week. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try next week, right? At that point, you've been in the business for two months. And a total of six people have seen the information. And then you look back at the business like, you know what? I just don't think this is for me. I know. <laughs> Guys, start now. Do it big. Do it scared. Do it fast. Do it excited. Just do it. Just do it. Don't slow down. Think of your business. Think of yourself as a plane that's in the process of takeoff, right? This organization this is your plane and you are the pilot. How many pilots do you know? Right, matter of fact, if you've been on a plane before, just drop a number five in the chat. Give me a high five. How many of you all have ever ridden on a plane before? You've ever gone through the process of going through the airport and sitting on a plane? If that's you, let me go ahead and see that. All right, cool, I see five, I see five, awesome. So think of yourself as a pilot in a plane. How many pilots do you know got off the ground in a plane by going five miles on the runway? I'll wait. It's impossible. 
There's no way that a plane can pick up that much momentum by going five miles. It has to go almost 200 plus miles in order to speed. That's the same thing as you being the pilot in FBS. If you want to see massive success, you're going to have to go on that runway and you're going to have to go fast. You're going to have to kill it. You're going to have to push through because what's going to end up happening is the first agent may say no. The first prospect might say no. The third prospect might say no, but then you get that, that fourth one, right? That fifth one, they say yes. Then you get that customer and then that customer refers you to another customer. And now you're starting to pick up momentum. Now your plane is taking this momentum off the ground. And now as you're ascending to the top, guess what ends up happening? As most planes, you're going to go through some turbulence. And that turbulence is going to shake you up. Your first agent, yeah, he quit on you. Your sister signed up and she was so excited. Ooh, sis, it's a family affair. Yeah, she quit on you, right? Your mom is like, look, I've been watching you do this thing for two, three weeks now. I don't believe in it. Now you're discouraged. You're going to go through turbulence because that's a part of what? The journey. That plane can't get to the ascension into its desired elevated state if it doesn't go through that turbulence. You can't always control the wind, just like you can't always control the people around you. The only thing that you can control is what? Me sitting in this chair as the pilot, me inside of this cabin controlling that steering. That's the only thing I can control. Everything outside of this is out of my control. And I'm not going to quit because of that. Otherwise, the plane crashes. So now, guess what? As you get through that turbulence, you finally get to a steady place. And look what you're doing. You're coasting. Now you fall asleep. Now it's on autopilot. You're making $1,000, $2,000, $3,000 a week. Hop on a couple of Zooms here and there. Encourage some people. Help some people get promoted. Help your leaders become better leaders. And all the while your organization is just being duplicated. That's how you build a massive network marketing business. And it's all contingent on what you do for the next 90 days. The same people who come to you throughout this process, everybody, and they say, oh yeah, I've heard of stuff like that. It doesn't work. And you say, well, why doesn't it work? Oh, well, you know, the person at the top makes all the money and I tried something like that. And you know, it just wasn't for me because I couldn't really do nothing with it. I didn't make no much money. I want you to ask them, well, when you started, were you consistent every single day? And I guarantee you they're going to say no. Because at the end of the day, it's about what we put in is what you get out. It's not like a job where you can half do it, right? I'm going to be PG tonight. You can half do it. <laughs> you can half donkey butt. You're at work, at, the, at work, right? Being on your phone, playing around in the back. Listen, I was a server when I joined this. I know. That's all we did was play around, right? <laughs> and... I still got paid though. This is not like that. This is performance based. You put in the work. And the beautiful thing about it, guys, is that it's not a complicated system once you follow it. So that being said, ladies and gentlemen, let's launch your business. You're part of one of the best companies out here, man. We are on track to being a billion dollar company. And all we're doing is referring people to a service that the world needs right now. You're a part of the journey now. You're locked in. Right. All you got to do is put in the work. Whenever you feel discouraged, go ahead and get back to your sponsor. Whenever you feel confused, get back to your support team. They'll help you out. But hop on these trainings consistently. Keep your head down. Put in the work. I'm telling you this because that's what I did. Nobody knew my name until they knew my name. Make a name for yourself. And I'll see you at the top, guys, because the bottom is too crowded. But listen, we never look down on anybody unless we're bringing them up. I appreciate you guys. I love you guys. Let's make this thing happen. Let's make 2021 the best year of our entire lives. Have a good night.